Hello students, in this video we shall discuss question number 2 of exercise 2.4. Chapter name is polynomials. Evaluate the following products without multiplying directly. So here we have 103 into 107. So if you do it directly, that means 103 into 107, how we generally multiply. But then we don't have to do it like this. We need to use the identities to multiply this. So this can be written as 100 plus 3 is 103 multiplied by 100 plus 7. The identity that we are going to use is x plus a into x plus b equals to x squared plus a plus b into x plus a b. Here x is 100, a is 3, b is 7. So now in this we will substitute that. So that will be equal to 100 squared plus 3 plus 7 into x plus 3 into 7 equals to 100 into 100. So that will be 4 zeros now. 1, 2, 3, 4. 10,000 plus 3 plus 7 is 10. 10. Uh, here in place of x we should have written 100. Okay. So 10 into 100 plus 3 sevens are 21. 10,000 plus 10 into 100 is 1000 plus 21. Now we will add this up. 10,000 plus 1000 plus 21. You can do this addition mentally. However, if you feel confused, you can write it like this and do it. So this is 1, 2, 0, 1, 1. The answer is 11,021. So this was the first question. Now we will do the second one. 95 into 96. First, we will write it as 90 plus 5 is 95 into 90 plus 6 is 96. The identity that we will use is x plus a into x plus b equals to x squared plus a plus b into x plus a b. Now here x is 90 so 90 squared plus a plus b. So 5 plus 6 into x, x is 90 plus a b. 5 into 6. 90 into 90. 9 nine is 81 and then 2 zeros plus 5 plus 6 is 11. 11 into 90 plus 5 6 is 30. 8100 plus 11 into 9 is 99 and then put a 0. So that's 990 plus 30. We shall add this up. 8100, 990 and 30. Add 0, 12, 11, 9. 9120 is the answer for the second one. Third and the last problem 104 into 96. So this can be written as 100 plus 4 is 104 and 96 we can write as 100 minus 4. So the identity that we will use is a plus b into a minus b because here 
A is 100, 100, B is 4, 4. That equals to A squared minus B squared. So here A is 100. That means 100 squared minus 4. 4 squared. 100 into 100 is 4 zeros will come. So that means 10,000 minus 4 4 is a 16. Now subtract 10,000 minus 16. 0 minus 6 we cannot do. So we need to borrow. This becomes 0, 10. Borrow from here, 10. Borrow from here. This will become 9 and this will become 10. So 10 minus 6 is 4. 9 minus 1 is 8. 9, 9. That's 9,984. And that's the answer for the third one. So this was question number 2. In the next video, we will do question number 3. Thank you.